morning bumblebeezies happy tuesday happy saint patrick's day i have my green on <laughs> um anyways already made my coffee i actually brewed a full pot today because i'm gonna put the rest in the refrigerator for iced coffees and then i poured myself a cup of hot coffee in my disneyland mug i'm also going to make some oatmeal for breakfast um, this one is the better oats thick and hearty this is really like the only oatmeal that I like because it's thick. It's kind of like crunchy. It's not mushy. AJ, did you find a green shirt? I did. Let's see it. Nice. There you go, green. You guys, my friend Loie is so sweet. She sent me a couple of stickers that she made on her Cricut. You probably can't see it, but it says Disneyland in the Disneyland like font. Um, so I'm actually taking off my stickers on my Hydro Flask. Uh, I'm gonna rearrange them, but I'm actually getting rid of a lot of the stickers that are on here because I'm tired of the theme. Because I kind of had like a Hawaii theme going on and I'm over it. So, I took off all of the Hawaii theme stickers. Well, I have this one that says Adventure is out there, which is not Hawaii. And then I have a Starbucks, but I'm gonna leave those off for now. All I have is Dunkin' Donuts, California, and that's it. Oh, and I have my Birkenstock stickers, which I'll put back on. But I'm gonna find a place for this Disneyland sticker. Probably put it like this on the side. And I think she said one is, well this one's, oh yeah, this one's matte. She made two because she didn't know which, which one I wanted. So one is matte and one is glossy. So I'm going to stick it on and then I'll show you guys what it looks like. Okay you guys, so here is my Hydro Flask. I put the Disneyland sticker like that. I think it looks, is it backwards on the screen? I don't know, but <laughs> it says Disneyland right there. And then I just kept the Birkenstock stickers, the California sticker, the palm trees, the coffee, and the Dunkin' Donuts. So, and I have one. Oh, I can still put the adventures out there, I guess. Maybe I'll put it down here. There you go. So I still have one more, the glossy one. I'm going to save that. I kind of put this on crooked. I don't know if you guys can tell. It's a little bit slanted, but I think it's okay. So thank you, Loi. I love my stickers. It is 4.42. I'm starting dinner right now. Well, I already started actually. I'm making sinigang for dinner. So in here I have some pork spare ribs and also pork belly. I already boiled it once and then I like to rinse it out, like rinse off rinse off the meat and get rid of like all the gunk. And then I add some fresh water and onion and tomato and we're gonna bring that to a boil. 
let it simmer until the meat is cooked, and then we will add the sinigang mix. This is what gives it the flavor, makes it sour, it's so good. And then for vegetables, I have broccoli, which is already cut and rinsed, ready to go. I have a jalapeno. Then I'm also going to add some long bean or string bean. I just need to cut that. Here is our sinigang, so yummy. Hey guys, welcome to the next time. Baking time. Today I'll be attempting to make brownies. This box we got from Costco, Ghirardelli Triple Chocolate. Let's see what we need. One pouch mix, one third cup of water, one third cup vegetable oil, and one egg. Beer back. Right now, I'm going to be making them. Here, yes. Okay, so what's, what are you going to do first? Put Place, that in here? Water, oil, and eggs in medium bowl and stir until fully mixed. Add brownie mix oh. and stir until well blended. Okay, so you need water, one third cup. Yeah. And then, oh. and then one third cup of vegetable oil. That's water. Water. <laughs> Same, one third? Yes. <clears throat> Just put that in the sink. Then what? The egg. That was my first time cracking an egg. Good job. I witnessed it here. You mixed that up. <laughs> Break the yolk. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Now we mix. Mix it good. Or does it say mix it good? Or yeah. We... Stir until well blended. Okay. Let me get your pan ready for you. Excuse okay. me. Your spray. Yeah. It wasn't her idea. Thank it you guys guys for watching my baking time. I'll check in with you guys later when they're done baking. Hey guys, it is the next day now and I'm going to show you guys the brownies that I made. I didn't I just forgot to film them yesterday. So here they are. They're really good. I really recommend you guys buying them. And this is what they look like. They're pretty good, and maybe next time we're going to use a smaller tray so they can be a little bit thicker because they're not as thick as we wanted them to be, but they're still really good, and I really recommend them. Bye. All right, everyone. It is that time again. You guessed it. It is time to go to sleep. Thank you guys for watching, and we'll see you guys tomorrow. Good night. Double whammy. Double whammy. You're going to get it one day.